Hello, welcome to Opto Materials. This is Dr. Noor and today I am going to explain you one of the important technique of retinoscopy. This technique is performed when you don't see or when dim glow is seen, especially in the conditions like a high refractive error, any kind of media opacity. So at your regular working distance, when you are not able to see the glow, you can use this technique and it is highly and very effective, especially in the conditions like a low vision. So let me tell you how this is performed. But first, the room illumination has to be dim. How we have learned in the previous few videos of the retinoscopy, the technique will remain the same. Only thing is, in this technique, you have to be closer to the patient's eye, as close as you can go. And this technique is known as a radical retinoscopy. Let me show you. So friends, at my regular working distance, the glow is very dull. I'm not able to appreciate the glow. So what I'll do, I'll go closer to the patient's eye till the time I am able to see the glow. So this, at this point, I'm able to see or appreciate the glow. I'm going to neutralize it with the, as per the movement. So I can see against movement and for the against movement, we have to use minus lenses. So friends, at this distance, I was able to neutralize this glow and the distance is 20 cm. So we have to adjust our working distance for this power, which was minus 5. So as we had neutralized the eye with minus 5 diopter and my working distance was 20 cm. So for 20 cm, if we divide 100 by 20, it will be 5 diopter as a working distance compensation. So total power for the eye will be minus 10 diopter. This is how we calculate and compensate the working distance. And this is how a radical retinoscopy is done. So hope this video was useful and informative to you. If you like this video, please share it ahead and subscribe the channel. See you again at our next video. Take care. Bye-bye.